I am Staff Sergeant Roy Bell. Uh, I'm in the United States Army. I've uh, been in the Army for 12 years, and I'm from uh, Charleston, South Carolina. Well, I suffered a traumatic brain injury uh, incurred through multiple IED blasts and rocket blast attack on our living areas. I wasn't immediately evacuated uh, because there was no loss of consciousness, uh, nor was I aware of the possible brain injuries that occur from blasts. And I didn't start getting tre treatment until I returned back home my last time. My last time, and um, I started incurring treatment through the symptoms that I was showing that uh, for me was completely blind. I, 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 I didn't notice any of my symptoms. I didn't know what they were. I thought it was just, you know, being me. Well, I was having problems uh, remembering things and putting things together, uh, sentences, words, trying to figure things out, what I wanted to do. Uh, I, I would have chronic migraines, like, all the time, almost every day, and it would be so bad, but I just had to push through. Uh, my balance is messed up. Uh, like some, I could just be walking, and all of a sudden I go off to the left, uh, and it wasn't just at one time. It was at any that could happen at any time. Uh, you know, you get up out of the bed at night to use the bathroom, and you all of a sudden run into a wall because you don't you you can't control where you're going. Uh, and the migraines, I could just wake up with migraines, uh, light light sensitivity. Uh, bright lights would hurt hurt my eyes and you know cause a headache. Through some through some of the therapy that I've been going to, I've noticed improvements in uh, concentration and and uh, remembering things. Uh, I, I, I'm not like I used to be. I don't know if I ever will be, but the therapy helps. I do speech pathology here at Walter Reed. I do uh, physical therapy. Uh, I've done occupational therapy. Uh, I've done balance therapy through the caring unit. And between the physical therapy and the caring therapy, it really helps me with my balance, uh, trying to help my brain retrain to what's right with my injuries. Because there's, nothing, there's not a way you can fix your balance except just to retrain your brain. Um, and it also helps with my back, because I, uh, I have a tear in one of my discs. Um, the speech therapy and occupational therapy helps me with my concentration, teaches me ways how to, how to think again and, you know, try to concentrate, really focus on doing what I got to do. I, I, my opinion, I feel it's hard to determine the emotional side of things with a TBI because uh, with my experiences, uh, I have been diagnosed with PTSD. And TBI and PTSD have some of the similar psychological uh, symptoms, but uh, you know it's different for everybody. I do uh, I do some therapy with my psychologist, and he teaches me ways to try to deal with things. But I've learned that a lot of the ways that I have adapted into are ways that my brain just kind of threw into a survival technique. It's how I live now. It's not really a way you can change that. So uh, I've been dealing with it for so long, I've just learned to control it a lot better than other people. The biggest thing that really helps me try to keep, keep on track and remember things is I got a PDA that uh, wanted to, there's a company that, that really cares about TBI patients and they qualify, they help them and give them some of the stuff. The biggest thing I could tell other TBI patients that, that are recently injured are just not to give up hope and try to stay calm and not get frustrated about everything. It's tough, it's real tough, but uh, there's light at the end of the tunnel. You know, just don't give up, stay focused, be patient, and you'll get better. You'll, you'll get better than what you are now.